We have spent many hours discussing a growth pact and also the multi-annual financial uh, framework. What we are seeing now is a clear sign that EU is, uh, has a firm and relentless determination to actually prom promote new growth and jobs in Europe. We know we have a crisis and we know we have to deal with that crisis, but at the same time we have tried all through these six months and before as well to promote growth and jobs. And now we have actually created the building blocks of a new growth and job, uh, jobs pact that we will hopefully agree tomorrow. We have tried to push for concrete and tangible results in terms of what we already got that could push growth and jobs. And let me just give you a few examples. We have the uh, proposal regarding the single market, regarding venture capital and the social entrepreneurship, which has just been adopted. On top of that, we have the standardization uh, directive. We have the energy efficiency directive. And I could actually go on because what we have achieved during the last six months is, is that we have, at the same time where we had the crisis, been able to take uh, decisions that will move us forward. All these things are put together now in a growth compact. And this, there is no doubt that when we adopt that, it will be a good push at the European level and on a national level for the growth and the jobs that we have been talking about for many, many months. So even though we are not quite finished, we will be finished tomorrow. And I think this will be a novelty that we are also able to have a light in the dark. A growth and jobs compact is a light in the dark. And hopefully we can give hope to the Europeans that we, we are able of taking positive decisions that will create growth and jobs in Europe. Thank you.